All right, everybody, welcome back to Scars Above. <clears throat> Hopefully, I think this might be the last uh, video. We'll just see how it goes. But it, it should be. It says I'm like 85% done with the uh, at the home screen before I log in to, or before the uh, start up the game. So hopefully I'm almost done. This game's taking a little longer than usual to uh, complete. But yeah, I'm here to collect. some three artifacts for the uh, I don't know I don't know what they're called I can't remember what the name is but I just call them the engineer Tetra was one of the first facilities the apparition by the creatures good people <clears throat> died one of them should have the access rod you have to look for it on their bodies Okie dokie. Gotta scan these losers. Oh my god. No good. Let's try this. Yep. I should check the body again. Let's see what this guy's all about. Okay. Did I scan this, Bubba? the upload note site. Cool. I should look for a way out of this place. I sure should. What do you think's in there? That's one way to do it. Can, oh my god. Uh, 
Okay. That did startle me a little bit. Can't, not gonna lie. I was startled. Got more points. Let's see. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Doo -doo. Okay. Uh, I still don't know how to do a fast reload or whatever. If it's just automatic or what. But yeah, I do need to get some more fiber. Yes, more knowledge. Okay. So I got one of these already. This rod. Not the right code. Oh my god. These access rods need to be calibrated for each area. Look around. There must be a code for it nearby. Oh my god. What is this? And that's the code. <sighs> Wrong code again. Maybe it's written somewhere around here. I should look for it. Yeah, but what do you what do you want me to do? How do I calibrate it? Oh. <sighs> Where's this fucking access rod? Ugh. Okay. Okay. I think that should be it. Look around for the code. Perhaps check if it's on the wall somewhere. Got it. That was kind of an, an unnecessary element. I could have done without it. Dude, what the fuck? Oh my god.
Those little guys suck. At least I got some fiber. Do, 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 do. So I guess I gotta go back to the monolith. Do this two more times. save recharge my batteries the access rock code was the same nice now to find the upload node come on now jesus the dodge and interact button is pretty annoying broken. There must be some other way inside. Okay, need to get some more fiber. That would be nice. Knowledge fiber. Knowledge. This thing. Uh, should I drop down? I'm in. Now for the upload node. Door's broken, made it through. I will attempt to break the encryption. Stand by. I will stand by. I know what you're trying to do. You will fail. Done. Barrier integrity down to two fields. I should go back to the monolith and choose the next location. Yep. Look for the second node. I like that. That's pretty fun and satisfying. The uh, creating your own bridge. Okay, lake. <clears throat> Sending you the location of the upload node in the area. Okay. Knowledge. My God. Let's see what's this the way you move to it. Cool.
I'll take it. this bad boy. Got him. Almost didn't make it. Okay. Hypothermia still going up or is it going to be going down? That's good. Okay. Another ability point. I think I only have these two left, so. I guess I'll do this one. Cool. Another save point. Sounds like she's freezing, but I have no hypothermia bars, so I'm thinking I'm good. The upload node is behind this gate. Okay. Okay. The power source. Looks like the locking mechanism is missing four power sources. I got one of them. <sighs> These guys. This guy. Yep.
Check this out, buddy. Beep. You fucking asshole. That teleportation one kind of sucked. <clears throat> the hologram with the uh, freaking uh, the hologram with the uh, time slow. It's the way to do it, I believe. Oh my god. President didn't get that last time, unless it respawned that fiber. Okay. Now we should be good to open this door after this little fetch quest. Okay, number two. Breaking the encryption. Stand by. Okay, apparition. I am your only way home. Bearing persistence at one third. We need just one more now. Let's get back to that monolith, baby. Baby! Tamara or is it Tamara? Because Tamara sounds too close to tomorrow. I guess it's the whole Anna, Anna kind of debate. Okay. Let's get this last one done. The upload node is nearby. I'm sending you the location. Okay. I'm waiting. I can't still be cold. <sighs> what is this? Flesh remains. You can't still be cold. Okay, so it's up here somewhere. glitch her still shivering 
even though we're not in the Arctic lake bed anymore. Okay. Good to go in there. Ta -da. Fiber. There's probably a lot of fiber around here because I wasn't using my gadgets a whole lot around this time. Water, electricity. All right, you gotta stop shivering. It's getting annoying. And if you're cold, put your jacket on. You're running around sleeveless. Got him! Oh. This uh, electric beam though is pretty tight. I think I like it better than the uh, than the rapid fire. But with the fl uh, the flame gun, I don't know. Damn it. And then I also tried to throw it a decoy, but uh, yeah, it didn't go through. What's over here? Over here. Come over here, buddy. I wonder where I will restart. Okay. <clears throat> this time, it's personal. Fiber. Make sure you get all the fiber. Anything up here? Nope. Okay, so this time I'm not going to attack all those uh, 
pop all those eggs that I was, uh, came across, uh, you know what I'm trying to say, Jesus, I can't even talk right now. Like all these eggs, try not to shoot those. Just like that. Yeah, y'all just stay over there. So much easier. Do not blow that up. See, what the fuck is that? Like... What the fuck? See what? I I don't I don't get it. I don't get it. You think fire would work on it, but I tried it before, it <clears throat> didn't seem to have any effect. I really don't need any more knowledge because I got all the abilities I can get.
Uh, well. I guess I'll stick with this for now until I get some more galvanic ammo. extra help. Go ahead and save. See how I'm doing on time. Here's the last one. Gotta get past this. Okay. to through here final one give me a moment oh I am the only one that's so lame home. without me you will never go back something is wrong oh that's just glass I thought it was barrier encryption. empty he is resisting I will need more time releasing specimen <sighs> oh Nothing. Hold on. Got he. Oh, my God. this drag on any more Are you ki are you fucking kidding me? God damn. This stamina thing s sucks. Where's this asshole at? Okay, so let's get uh, this over here. Go that way. Get that. Put that there. Done. 
got him. We should be able to access the vessel now. We should head back to my facility. The recompilation of the Matrix should be done by now. Let's head back. Should be ready. Cool. Uh, which way do I go? I'm just gonna go this way. Right? to just the species available on this planet, including my creators, is the reason why I still haven't been able to unlock the code. But now, with new samples, I'm so close to achieving my purpose. <clears throat> I might need to revisit the planet of That's these humans soon. Obtain a larger batch. He's planning another trip to Earth. I must stop him. Yep, we already knew that. Dang, I got five ability points. Fiber. Kind of just ready to get this uh, final boss over with, you know what I'm saying? For some reason, this game's taking forever to uh, get through. It's just, it said it was like seven hours or something. It seems like a lot more than that. Fiber. Ah! Let's just give you some to play with. resurrect your people our physiology is more complex than yours we can't replicate our neural system okay rude I see just lesser creatures than like us you're not lesser Kate if anything you've showed me how resourceful and capable your kind is but you're also very young as a species Kind of just cut her off. That was rude of me. All right, press next. Teleport to the laboratory. Press any button. All right, that way, that way, that way. Let's try this way. Oh my God. Never mind. What the fuck? Where the hell did that come from? 
<clears throat> what the fudge? Okay. Laboratory up ahead. Five skill points that I can't spend. Because I'm just so dang good. The recompilation is complete. The seat is ready, and the barrier is down. Take it. One final thing remains. You Got need it. the master access to activate the monolith connection to the vessel. This better not be another side quest. I just wanna... Just let me destroy this dude, you know? Connectome transfer complete. The MD is ready. I will store her essence. This is... you. In a way. Her name was Naya. She was a scientist, and one of the custodian's creators. Hey, Naya. She always looked at the universe with eyes wide open. But her hunger for knowledge, her desire to unlock the code made her blind. And for that, she and those mm. around her paid the ultimate price. Mm. Before yep. her demise, she That'll realized do it. that the custodian would not stop with her people. She learned of his plans to reach across the stars and find new species, new specimens to Saudi Arabia, on. Africa. Her own kind was South responsible America, for their America, fate. Central America, North but America. But not these people. Naya couldn't bear the guilt for them as Australia, well. Australia, Asia. So she created another entity, similar to the custodian but smaller in scope, made out of just one connectome, her own. She gave the entity her mind, but also her heart, as you would say. The purpose of this entity would not be to find the code of life, but rather to aid life. To aid you, Kate. She created Thank you. me. Naya made me in her image, and out of her own neural map. The her apparition. Her memories, her being. I became a whisper of what she once was. And then I was imprinted to you. They're nanomachines in your body, inserted when you were resurrected for the first time. After I died in the Hermes crash. Yes. yes. Only these nanomachines did not mutate you. Instead, they brought us together. They put me in your mind. And they nice. did something else, too. You see... Naya could not stop the cool. experiment, as the custodian had already taken full control. But she was able to give you a special state within it. Using the nanomachines, she gave you the status of a control variable. The system would restore you in case of death or mutation, and keep you as a constant, alive and unchanged. Naya hoped this would give you a chance to stand against the custodian and protect your people against him. She was right. And now, you must take the fight to him. You just need the master access. Once it is consumed... I've been trying. You will be able to reach the vessel and reach his core. How do I get this master cool. access? You already have it. I am the master access. I am the master access. Go to the monolith. I will do the rest. I I just wanted you to see her before I go. I wanted you to see me. I I'm glad you did. Oh, I see you. Oh, I see you, girl. Over here got me all flustered and shit.
And I certainly wish I could teleport over there. That would be fun. <clears throat> you really want me to be tired before I get to the big final boss. Oh. All right. I will input the coordinates to the vessel and grant you master access. This will consume me. And Thank I you. I will not be able to aid you further. Naya. The custodian is aware you're coming. He will oh. defend himself. You must insert the seed into his core, which will destroy both him and the vessel. You will die, but the system should restore you back on the planet. However, the custodian was right, Kate. This will also destroy your means of getting back to your world. We don't have a choice. We'll find another way back to Earth. The custodian must be stopped. Agreed. I will leave something for you. A parting gift. Maybe it will Please. show you a path back home. You will find it in the monoliths after your bath. I am sad I won't be around to see you defeat the custodian. But after watching you all this time, I have no doubt you will prevail. I believe in you. Okay. Kate, your people Somebody's have such thirsty. potential. Do not repeat our mistakes. But never stop searching for answers. Uh, we won't. Never stop being hungry for knowledge. But we probably will. Goodbye. Goodbye, Naya. Thank you. Goodbye. For everything. Oh, that was sad. But life moves on. This is the inside of the metahedron. It's this is inside of the metahedron. Mesmerizing. Mesmerizing, bro. It's so freaking trippy, dude. You've got this, Kate. Uh, I know you do, because I'm in control. I'm playing. Okay. And I'm the base. I have decided to offer you a way back to your planet. A gift from one side to another. Will awaken on your home world. This will all be just a distant memory. The remaining human cool. specimens will suffice. I am close to unlocking the code, right. fulfilling my mission. You will find solace in hey, the all yours, buddy. That you were a part in one of the greatest discoveries in the history of sentient life. I will not leave my friends here with you, monster. Yo. You're not surviving this. Disappointing. I preferred the optimal solution to this conundrum. Disappointed! Would benefit all sides. But you leave me no choice. It's only a matter of time before I break the protection my creator granted you. Ooh. What the heck? Looks like something from Beast Wars. Transformers. Is that giving him help? There we go. Get out of here. Oh. Uh, 
All right. Oop. Get some more ammo. Oh, Get that booty out of here. Fuck. Use your fucking thing. God damn it.
Any more ammo? Can I get some more ammo up in here? Six skill points. Not bad. <clears throat> Is this the core? I have to insert the seed. I alone have the story of my life <laughs> to bring you back to your home world. Ending me will sever that possibility. The knowledge will be lost. One of the universe's greatest mysteries will remain locked forever. Reconsider, human. You will never see your planet again. This is for Richard and Naya, you monster. Do I still have to do something? Nope. Oh! Look at all those meteor potential meteorites meteors right now <laughs> hello friends Kate! Personal log. Guy who's been knocked out the Mission entire game. Mission Specialist Kate Ward. The entity known as the Custodian, the one responsible for everything that happened to the SCAR team, has been destroyed. His existence endangered not only members of my team, but potentially all of Earth as well. And who knows how many more worlds. He was a product of recklessness rather than malicious intent. But the consequences of his actions were tragic nonetheless. So many lives lost, including our mission commander, Richard Robinson. He will be dearly missed. Sorry, Dick. Naya and her people, creators of this place and of the custodian, were in many ways similar to humans. Scientists, explorers, seekers. They discovered something incredible. Something that might hold the secret to all life. Perhaps this was a mystery that was not meant to be unlocked so soon. Their fate should be a warning to us all, but not a deterrent. If anything, I now know that even in the vastness of universe, there are others like us. People looking for answers. That gives me hope and makes the great distance from home just a little smaller. Naya left us her gift, just as she said. The monolith has the coordinates of a planet that I hope supports human life. I believe it to be Naya's homeworld. I don't know what awaits us there. New dangers, new discoveries, perhaps even a means to return to Earth. These are all unknowns. But what is certain is that we stand together. Mike, Tam, and I. We are scientists. We are a team. We are scars. We will find our way home. It was all a dream. I'm just joking. All right. So that was uh, a. Was a. Uh, I wouldn't say it was like. I don't know. 
I had fun with it uh, at times, and then at times I had frustrating time with it. But uh, yeah, a lot of it was like, it seemed too short and too long at the same time. Like, the story seemed like it was the bullet points of a of a full length story and when they crammed it together like just the highlight parts of it it seemed like the story was just kind of fast forwarding it instead of, instead of like unfolding organically and but like a lot of the characters like I didn't really have a connection with like Tam and Mike who has passed out for three fourths of the game uh, but yeah, if we, I guess if we had more time with the, with the crew, <clears throat> or if they were incorporated more into the story, I'd probably have more of a connection with them or something, but, uh, yeah, this person's shredding on the guitar, though, or the keys, whichever, but yeah, they're just going to town, but, uh, yeah, but I, I did like the, uh, the actual like combat that was cool like the different weapons the uh you know the electric gun the fire gun the ice gun the acid gun and each uh enemy has like its own weakness like, that was cool and that was fun uh the stamina was a little uh annoying well it wasn't a little annoying it's very annoying a lot of the time uh not a big fan of that but uh yeah the combat was pretty cool uh, if there was any way they could, like, I don't know. Because, like, when you have the bullet points like that, and they're just kind of, like, loosely tied together, then you don't really give a shit about the story, and you're just kind of, like, going through the motions of a story instead of being invested. Uh, so, if they even simplified the story even more and just had non-stop gameplay, I think this game would be a lot better received. I think it'd be better received than it was. But that's just me being like an armchair critic, kind of, you know, giving my two cents. I didn't develop the game, I didn't create the game, I didn't create the story. But yeah, it was, uh, it was interesting. I'm glad I played it. Uh, I think it maybe even would have been better just to cut out the story entirely. You just stranded on a planet trying to survive. Like a, like a, intergalactic version of green hell or I guess interplanetary extraterrestrial version of green hell anyway uh yeah that was my thoughts I hope you liked it I uh, hope you enjoyed it I don't know what I'm gonna do next now that this came out uh, now that I'm done with this because Hellblade 2 just came out and it looks like that's an exclusive for Xbox which I don't have uh, so I don't know We'll see what comes down the pipe. Keep your eyes and ears open. Have a good day. See you next time.